Today we're going to be looking at the MakerBot Replicator Mini Plus and we're going to be using it with our iPad um, to do some print. Um, to do this you'll need the MakerBot app and of course your printer. Um, with the printer turned on uh, you just go into the app like this and then if I show you the different features you can print from your library and um, so these are all the different files we've added to our library um, and you can also um, explore Thingiverse so you can get any file you like from Thingiverse. If you just go in you can search for something specific or or browse the uh, website. Uh, but we're going to do a print from our library today. We just go into uh, the Thingiverse file and then select my designs. This will bring up all of our designs that we've uploaded to Thingiverse and we'll um, select this one here. And you can see all the, uh, the details here on the print. And if we select the file that we're going to print, it comes up with this window here. And it gives you the option to select whether you want to add a raft or add supports. And you just select like that. Um, so we're, we're just going to leave raft selected, but we know we don't need supports with this print. Um, so then if we select um, send to printer, the printer will make that um, note and then you can see in the bottom right hand corner we've got a notification on the screen and it's asking us to clear the build plate and this is just to make sure that you haven't left the print on there and it shows you um, the onboard camera um, which is a live feed as you can see and then um, what you'll need to do is click the button on the front which should be flashing yellow just to confirm that the build plate is clear and once you've done that, the uh, print should begin and everything will begin heating up. Okay, so that's our print finished, um, and as you can see, it's turned out well. Um, so we just set it up on our uh, mobile device, uh, which works with uh, Apple and Android devices, which is really good. Um, and the unique feature is that you can just sort of set it, set it to go. Um, you don't need to use your uh, desktop computer to do it. Um, you do get fairly standard uh, print settings, um, which is nice because you know that it's going to work. Um, you can even um, just leave it to kids to do. Um, and they'll get, they'll get the prints out that they want um, from Thingiverse um, in quite a user-friendly way. Um, but if you've got any other questions about this product um, or want to know more about the app, um, just let us know in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment and subscribe. Also, come follow us on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. You can find out more about our products and services by visiting dream3d.co.uk.